Britain is facing a harsh reality of as the new Labour government declares the nation is broke and broken. According to Prime Minister Keir Starmer, the assessment will show that Britain is broke and broken, revealing the mess that populist politics has made of the economy and public services. Following a landslide victory on July 4th, the Labour Party has taken control of the world's sixth largest economy, only to uncover a 20 billion pounds shortfall. Chancellor of the Exchequer Rachel Reeves is set to present a fiscal review to Parliament, laying the blame on the previous Conservative government. The previous government made significant funding commitments without knowing where the money would come from. The review highlights the dire state of public services and the economy, painting a grim picture of unfunded commitments and financial mismanagement. Conservative spokesperson said Labour's claims of a black hole in public finances are a fabricated pretext for future tax rises. Some economists are skeptical, arguing that Labour should have been aware of these financial challenges before taking office. Reeves will also announce the date for her first budget and set out plans for a formal spending review. Amid these challenges, Labour is expected to agree to above inflation pay awards for teachers and health workers. How Labour will address this financial crisis remains to be seen. With promises not to raise major taxes, the road ahead will be tough. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on this and other important stories.